Hello Aries and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of March 8th through the 14th and this is a very general reading. Also I did post the monthly March reading so if you didn't um, see those you can check those out. Okay so let's take a look here. There is something for some of you you're working on. Hmm. I do see this is like um, a new cycle opening up for some of you. It's like um, additional to money or it's like you're taking care of some responsibility or errands or something that you've kind of slacked on. That is one thing. And it's going to help you. You have a victory. Some kind of victory is showing up here, and it's a really new path that's opening up, a new cycle. Um, this can be thoughts of someone that you haven't seen in a while. There can be a sweet reunion. That is for some of you, okay? Some of you are on the way of like creating your own business, your own side business, and it's just putting in a lot more, you know, it's putting in the work, nurturing and taking care, caring taking care of it. It looks like it will be a lucrative thing in the future. Okay. Well, a lot of the fears you had and a lot of worries, um, some of you that is going to change this week for some of you. I do see music can be involved this week. I do like that. There is an energy here of getting, you know, you're surrounded by kind of anger or a little bit of um, jealousy. And it's something that you have to analyze because I feel this is some of you. It's your energy. Um, and it's seeing why, why you feel that way about someone because there's almost like an energy if this person isn't even aware of it. I don't know if that is for some of you. But it does surround you. I do see you taking back your power. You, you've learned a lot of lessons, so I do like that. And I do see you're getting a lot of things, you know, they're coming, you know, falling into place and um, it's coming under control. Some of you need to still address these issues that we just went through. And it's like low self-esteem issues, too. For some of you, there's an energy of a cancer, OK, or dealing with someone uh, like with the energy of a cancer. It's almost like you feel either inferior or you blame this person is a possibility. But I'm, you know. I see a get together. This can be an unexpected celebration. Okay, so it's there for a lot of you. I see happy energy, um, communications coming through. A lot of help around you. Counting the blessing, counting your blessings is showing up. You know, a lot of things are just going to fall into place. You get what you want when you least um, when you when you least expect it. I do see some kind of victory. Um, this is a good time for work, career. This is starting something on the side, a second source of income for some of you. You're kind of juggling, but you'll have more than enough. I do see here that a lot of delays um, or obstacles this week are in your favor, okay? A lot of you are doing some soul searching. Okay, keeping more things discreet. There's a lot of wisdom and there's a lot of um, um, intuition here you're going to have to draw upon. Mm, for love, it looks like some of you have a secret love affair going on or you're keeping a relationship secret and private. Matters of the heart is coming through. I do see that. For some of you, this could be an an argument or I just see your temper here at Mayflare. Talk is going to be important, but I do see jealousy. This is like um, in matters of the heart. There could be some jealousy issues too between you and a person. So I'm seeing that kind of energy. For some of you, this is great with a contract job or... If you're already in some kind of a contract, it's like you're going to be trying to kind of get out of it. 
I see talk counsel is needed, but you know what? Following your own intuition and advice is going to be very important this week too. Matters of the heart is showing up and some decisions. Okay. Interesting, um, Aries. All right, Aries, that was your reading for the week of uh, March 8th through the 14th. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll catch you back next week for our next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best, and bye for now.